Last year, we got this amazing collaboration from Vans and Sailor Moon. Now, it has been a long time that I've had these shoes and I haven't posted a video about them. You saw all of my normal shoes that anybody could get, but I also created I want to say five or six different custom pairs of Sailor Moon shoes that were specifically based on the designs that they had available on the Vans Customs website, but I specifically wanted to make them into something that I would wear quite consistently. So today I'm going to show you my custom shoes. I'm going to make a couple of recommendations in terms of what kind of Vans I would wear, especially for like long periods of time or like at conventions if you're going to anime cons. And hopefully this video is useful to you in terms of making your own customs. I don't believe that these designs are still available on the customs website. However, if they are, I will put that information on the screen here. And if you are looking for reviews of the entire Vans collection, practically the entire line. I did separate videos about my experience going into my local Vans store, and I did a video reviewing all of the products that I bought from that collaboration last year. So let me go ahead and show you my Vans customs. I have so many of them. They're so cute. I love them. Okay. I have five pairs that I can show you. I'm just going to, I'm just going to pile them up here on my table. We don't care, right? <laughs> All right, now this pair of custom Vans shoes, I actually wore to Japan and I got so many compliments from locals that lived in Tokyo. When I wore these to the Sailor Moon Museum, there was this like group of schoolgirls who stopped me in front of the museum. They were all Japanese, didn't speak any English, but they freaked out. So I'm assuming that in Japan, maybe you didn't have access to the customs designs. I know they had Vans designs there, but maybe not the customs setup. So maybe it was just a US or a different market thing, but I was able to wear these to Japan and I got so many compliments. People love these. These were extremely comfortable. There was one day that I was walking around Shibuya and I think I hit like 25,000 steps for the day because we were, <laughs> me and my local friend from Tokyo, we were hunting down this very specific whiskey that my husband wanted and it's very hard to find. So we had to go to like all these department stores to find it, but total tangent. I wore these a lot and they were very comfortable. I didn't get any blisters. I really, really wore them in so they're nice and flexible now and they're just so comfortable to wear. So even if this design still isn't available, these types of shoes from Vans are super, super comfy and so wonderful to wear for a full day. So these designs have Luna on the side with the transformation pens for the inner guardians. We also have the communicator in the background and we have the moon stick. Sailor Moon's brooch. We have the disguise pen and Artemis on one side. I really like that I was able to customize every bit of this. Like I added this pink stripe. I added these pink grommets, pink laces, and I also included this kind of a greenish teal edging for these shoes. I thought it looked very nice. And the tongue matches the color that you see in here. So I really went for this like very bright, vibrant coloring, lots of pastels and just super fun. Both of these are exactly the same as well. So you see the same print on both of them. You can tell that I've definitely wore them quite a bit since I'm already wearing out the label on the inside. Very comfortable, highly recommend. Now these ones are the same type of shoe, just a completely different design going into the shoe. Uh, while I could have gone crazy with the colors on these, I decided to keep them mostly white except for the fabric. So on these, I have this very loud, super fun imagery of Sailor Moon on all sides. She's all over the place. But for the rest of the shoe, I decided to go for white. Since there's already so much happening with the shoe, I didn't want to make it too insane. <laughs> I mean, it's already kind of crazy, but I felt like this was like the perfect combination of nice white tennis shoes, but with a very fun fabric design on them. So you'll see that I included the white stripe here. I left this white. I even left the tongue white as well as the white grommets. I like that Sailor Moon is featured all over this design on all sides. And I like that her face isn't necessarily cut off in many areas, except for like right here and up here. So these are really cute and super fun. Next, I got two pairs of the 
uh, slightly more plush versions of Vans. Uh, this first one, I decided to get a suede upper. I thought that the suede upper, the color of it, which is almost like a pastel pink, really works with the design that goes into the fabric here. These are going to be dirty. Yes, I have worn them, so please don't judge them too much. They are definitely dirty. I use my products that I like to purchase, so please don't judge them too much. But these are definitely very plush on the inside. So far, this like almost pleather upper has not started to peel or has not started to break apart. So I'm doing pretty good so far. And you can tell that I have been wearing these. So they have been lasting really well when I bend them because I do wear my shoes. I'm not a collector who does not bend shoes. I bend shoes because I wear them. <laughs> People judge for like bending shoes. It's so weird. Um, you will notice that the sole has not come apart from the fabric either. And that was an issue that I used to have with Vans, but maybe they've, um, maybe they've improved the quality a little bit but so far these are working out really well for me so very happy with these just like the other design you will notice that you have the same design on both shoes now similar to those i also got these ones which are the same model of vans shoes but just with a different uh, design going into them so these ones i'm calling these my Americanized shoes. These are like my July 4th shoes that I would wear on July 4th. Red, white, and blue, very, very themed, very on brand for like American USA type of stuff. But they also have Sailor Moon all over them, so they do have a touch of yellow. So here you can see my USA July 4th shoes. I added the red band here. I also kept the grommets white to kind of accent the blue upper and I changed it out to red laces as opposed to white. I really like this blue, it's almost like a canvas type of material. I made the tongue blue as well to match the fabric that you have here. These are so, so, so fun. I feel like they would really complement a, maybe like a red skirt or something like that. Kind of going for a casual slash cutesy vibe. I think these would look adorable. So I'm looking forward to wearing these for like, Memorial Day and <laughs> July 4th and stuff like that. <laughs> the last pair that I got are the most unique and interesting ones in my opinion. And these are a pair of slip-ons. So I really like the slip-ons that Vance announced that came with the collaboration. So I decided to make my own custom slip-ons too, mainly because I did want to feature the inner guardians using the last custom art that they had available on the custom site. Uh, they only had the three different art options, but also because I wanted to experiment a little bit with fabrics. So in this case, I did do that experimentation. For these, I went with a black sole, which is going to be great for keeping them from looking dirty. So it's not white. I was able to switch these to black. I added this light pink band around the soles all over. And then I went with this pink upper. I also went with this pink edge around the edges here. I went with a black piece right here on both sides, that piece of elastic. And then we have this lovely print of the inner Sailor Guardians on the front. Now I will mention, this is not the clearest art print. It's very hard to see the details in there. You can tell who they are obviously. But other than that, like there's not a lot of detail going into their faces. There's not a lot of detail in their eyes. So the printing quality is not excellent, but they're decent. Now the fun part of these slides is that they had the option to include this really cute glittery fabric. And <laughs> I don't know why I chose it. I thought it would look so cool. And I still think they look so cool. <laughs> they're kind of adorable. If I was going for a punk rock vibe, I would totally wear these to like a concert or something. The slides are very comfortable. I wear my current slides, the ones that came from the original collab, all the time. I wear them around the house all the time. I use them whenever I'm taking my dog out to go potty. I just slip those on and wear them outside. They're very comfortable. They get worn in and kind of shaped to your foot quite quickly. So I would definitely recommend the slides as well. All over, like I've been a fan of Vans for many, many years, and I've been very happy with their quality, especially for the price point. And the fact that we had 
collaboration items that had to do with Sailor Moon. I really, really hope they release another collab in the future that includes the Outer Guardians as well, because there are a lot of fans out there who love the Outer Guardians as well. So it would be cool to see something based around maybe Sailor Moon S or Sailor Moon Stars even, given that Cosmos is coming out this summer. I would love to see a second line that includes the Outer Guardians. So that's my spiel. Those were my Vans customs. I hope you love them as much as I do. I'm very happy that I have so many different shoes to choose from so I can pretty much wear Sailor Moon shoes every single day. Yay! <laughs> my dream has come true. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Sailor Snubs, Janet.